finally. Just a few jumps away from home where I can put all these hallucinations. Yes, everybody knows there's going to be a weird cut in this episode because every time it goes to a cut scene, uh, my screen does something a little weird, so I'm afraid to click out of it. <laughs> what does it do? It looks like he wants to go to windowed mode and then goes back to full screen. Oh, really? It does it fast. I don't think you've seen it happen. And Infinity Plus. But uh, it makes me nervous. <laughs> so, and it is an 11 year old game, so. Right. Yeah, see, like right there, it happened again. The arm sticking out of my head looks weird. The what? Uh, the arm sticking out. Oh, this is where he learns he, nobody can see it. it right. Weird, uh, but There's no arm sticking out of your head. Ray, are you going nuts on me? Are you dropping insanity balls on the floor? Hell yeah. No, I, oh, I don't think so. You really can't see it? Sweetie, why don't you go see my shrink? Dr. Egglesworth helped me a lot. I'm not afraid of grapes anymore. Jeez. <laughs> ah, Maybe I am crazy. I guess it wouldn't hurt to see Dr. Egglesworth. I believe his office is over here, uh, to the right. I really like how it's right and left description. Yes. Because I... I Oh, it's a billboard. I really like how it, it's a right and left description. Like, it's its like, oh, we, well, we know you're playing a game. Right. Ah, that's him. He's the one who took your sacred thingamabob. I know because he has a stupid haircut. I don't forget <laughs> a haircut that dumb. That's how I dial phones. <laughs> Agent 23 reporting in. We may have a positive on our target. Instructions. Get him. Wait, is this real? Am so you I will get this in parts of this game. I, okay. To where you're being chased by the agents. Right now. Gotcha. I know, it's just so sad. Oh, Dr. Ecclesworth, if only you hadn't taken the death of your father so hard and fallen into deep depression. I'm glad you're seeing Dr. Brom. I'm also glad I'm paid by the hour. Take as long as you <laughs> need, Dr. Ecclesworth. <laughs> now I have to go see Dr. Brom. Right. Oop. And... Yep. Ah, oh. Hello. Yeah, possibly imaginary suckers. So that's basically the the threat of the game. Right. Is you're gonna have to outrun the Where secret agents. That's a gentleman who loves digging six foot deep holes. This is basically the perfect job for me. Man. Except for the constant and omnipresent of a spooky haunting. A spooky haunting. <laughs> oh, there was a cutscene over here. Dagnabbit! I'm dead now! Well, that's an inconvenience for me, but it's not going to shut down my practice. Is that brown? There's still tons of people out there who need lobotomies. Stay away from me with your lobotomies, man! Also, you're not as scary as I was expecting. I'm not scary. I'm a lobotomist. And it's the only way to cure what ails you, Sonny. A few cuts, a few slips, and you won't have a care in the world. Whoa. When has talking about your issues ever solved anything? Action speaks louder than words, and that action is cutting out brain parts. I read that as brain farts. <laughs> That's a gentleman. Okay. Oh, can't see behind the wall, apparently. Oh, no. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. Nice. That's great. <laughs> I really like that. There we go. <laughs> hey, those guys are snappily dressed. They're probably pretty smart. May 
Maybe. Maybe I should mind. <laughs> Whoa. I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos. <laughs> Yet I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. Oh man! Why would I swear? What's the matter, Brian? <laughs> just punch him to sleep. Oh right. <laughs> you just stick him to sleep. Wake up. Oh right. Okay. Oh, this is heavy. I've got to get to that psychiatrist stat. Wonder Wiener. <laughs> Look at that face. It's carnival. There we go, Excuse I got to his me, office. Yeah, doctor. <laughs> um doctors? Dr. Brom, I can't go back to work. I just can't. Dad hated how I practiced my profession, and now that he's gone, we'll never reconcile. There we go. There's oh. no closure left. Okay, for me. got it. I'll never be able to talk to him again. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? Sad, I guess. Mm-hmm. <laughs> how does that make also, you feel? Also, I love that there's a lava lamp. Right? The sadness? No, um, like, not happy. Like, I have emotions that are making me... Depressed. So the ghost was his dad. Yeah, that's what I realized. And how does that make you? I probably should have figured that out from the secretary phone call, but how I didn't. Does that make you feel? Fine, thank you. But we're here to discuss you. Dang. Whoops. Uh, I gotta help Dr. Egglesworth so that he can help me. Wow, did work get a lot easier when I realized I could ask. And how does that make you feel? <laughs> Every question. If only I could talk to my dad one more time. Get him to understand why I do what I do. I, I just need also like shot. that Man, they have I need, a uh, I need a medium. An audio filter that they put over when you're reading the minds. Right. Necromancers it's a good touch, I think. Do they? No, uh, I think they're all frauds. Okay. Medium it is. <laughs> So now, no yes, there we I go. have made contact with the spirit of your dear departed wife. I haven't departed anywhere. I can't move in the afterlife because my husband cut off my legs. Ta -da! <laughs> Is she here? Is she Can you ask her, her if legs? she's mad that I cut off her legs? She's saying that she is um, slightly frustrated by the circumstances. If I could touch him, I'd tear his legs off too! Yeah, definitely sensing some frustration. After I apologize for cutting off her legs, I should ask her if she knows where I put my rabbit. I haven't seen him for weeks. And rabbits don't just disappear. <laughs> oh, wait, no. I made him disappear and then couldn't get him back. Okay. Note to self. Stop by pet store on the way home. I can't walk into the light or anywhere else for that matter. Either someone needs to find me some legs or someone needs to kill a wheel. <laughs> send its ghost over my way. Like, to kill a wheelchair. I'll get you, hey Steve. <laughs> how amazing it is that ghosts really do exist. And how incredible that they all want to talk with my paying customers. At least this ghost knows our language. I'm so tired of being bothered by caveman ghosts from thousands of years ago. <laughs> okay. Next step. The missing link. King yeah. Neptune? Balloons. Well, balloons for sale. Good I like shapes and, yeah. shapes and colors, especially when those shapes are inflated. Sometimes I wonder if this is really what I was put on this earth to do. Matter, Brian? Yes, I'm always thinking about the state of shapes like that. <laughs> I mean, that's... Balloons for sale. Take the healing Balloons for sale. Yep. All right, round 37. Whoever has the shortest legs gets punched. Okay. 
Ready, Gigator? Ready, Colossus? Ready, little champ? What? No! No! One, two, three, go! Wait, no, wait! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, are they... Hey, Jace! Jace! They're about to pull off the rally scene trampoline trivets maneuver! Ladies and gentlemen, this trick is very difficult to pull off. Let's watch. A complete success and a very painful landing for little champ. <laughs> a very painful Point landing. Ah, Jace, the greatest Jace. show on earth. As long as you don't let yourself feel empathetic for the mini guy. <laughs> Normally, people say bully like it's a bad thing. But have they tried it? It rules! If my legs were longer, I wouldn't get punched. I could run away to freedom. I could follow my dreams of being in library school instead of this library degrading school. <laughs> show. <laughs> Punches make me feel good. Uh, that won't stick. Oh, I didn't think there was more to the right. <laughs> Whoa! I should have not stayed up all night left. Last night eating burritos. And yeah, I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. Whoops. Fire? Who has a cold heart now? Burn, 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 fire burn! The ozone is amazing. Yup, Sonny! You're leaving the crowds waiting! <laughs> Oxygen tank. The yep. must go on! Dad, I'm scared! He's hitting him with I an inflatable you. hammer. I'm <laughs> Then on heights once you hit the bottom. He's got a point. Jump, dang it. Dad, I don't want to fall to my death. Please stop hitting my hands. Next time. I'm not bringing the inflatable hammer. Jump. Jump. There right we go. Now. Come on, we're not that high up. Help me, son! Dad, uh, I can't. If I uh, let go, I'll die. Help me, please! Dad, I'll die! <laughs> Welcome to the High Voice crew. I confess I cannot see the attraction to being fired out of a cannon, but I do see the attraction of being responsible for the safety of those who do choose this path. I will. I like it when the cannon makes the fire go out <laughs> and I'm inside the explosion. Okay. Okay. So, oh, fire. Yeah. Fire? Oh, that was awesome! I uh, think. Okay. Bullseye. Yep. <laughs> the, uh, what are we aiming at? How come we're not hitting the usual wall? Fire again. Yep. And cannon. Right on target. Right. <sighs> this isn't part of the end. Dad, I've got 
don't you? Whoa! This is an amazing trick! <laughs> you did this yourself? I kinda... You know, it's not so scary when we're both hanging here together. This is the best trick ever! This is perfect! You're perfect! Oh. <laughs> Okay. Now we got a smile. <laughs> uh, that won't stick. No, I don't need... She needs legs. Yeah, I don't know how that would help um, with the wrestlers. Mm, long sticker. Hmm. Was there another something I missed? Well, it seems to be the end of that area. What are we forgetting? Do you put it on fire, guy? Oh. <laughs> Whoa. I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos. And yet I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. Crap. <laughs> I think... Oh, yes, hello. Well, take a good look. I'm the bearded Here lady. I am, the bearded lady. Isn't that crazy? Doesn't that mess with your ideas of gender and beauty? <laughs> I, I guess. It's right, Brian. <laughs> it's too real. Right. Does it just, uh, is it too woke? <laughs> it's amazing what a little super glue, a shaved dog, and a lot of patience can do. There's glue. Oh, fast travel. Oh, nice. Okay. I did not expect there to be a fast travel in this game. Okay, so... Glue. Yeah, I'm trying to think. What would I need the glue for? Got it. <laughs> okay, that's fire. I don't need fire. They're fine. They're fine. Oh, oh. the trampoline? Oh, maybe. Maybe on the trampoline. Yep. yep. The trampoline privilege maneuver! Here we go! Your backs into it, boys! Not a problem! Get ready to have your mind's body slammed! Always Not ready to have my mind body slammed. <laughs> There's our legs. Wait a second! Your legs are tinier than mine! You've been faking this for years, Gigator! Library school, here I come! Oh ho ho! Our wrestling slash bullying. <laughs> Say, kid, there's an opening. You ever give any thought to being paid to push other men around in a padded square with elastic walls? Disposable balloon. You should buy it. Okay. Legs, ghost. <laughs> oh, perfect. Legs out of nowhere. This will definitely be all I need in my eternal afterlife. Goodbye, sweetie. I loved you more than I love even magic itself. Which is too bad, because if I studied magic harder, you wouldn't have died. 
Okay, I'm glad that's done. So, handsome, how long do you think it'll be before you get back into dating? Oh, I don't know, a few minutes? Well, that'd be quite the trick. <laughs> Gotta get that hat. Can you hold two things at once? Who's the man? No. Huh. Where would the smile go? Oh. You gotta put it on the ghost ad, right? Do I? Yeah, you put. I'm guessing you put that on the ghost ad and then the hat that the medium uses to see ghosts on the other doctor. I'm guessing I've not played this game before. Wasn't there a cool guy back here? Yeah, there, yep, there he is. <laughs> he lost you. Ah. Hmm. Nope. I was wondering about that. Okay. Yeah, he like sees you, you can't do the thing. Right. It has to be over here where I have to put the happy. Ha, huh, this mouth is so happy. Ha, huh, this mouth is so happy. <laughs> My wife wouldn't want me to. It's a game. It's my professional code to flirt with patrons. But something about him is just magic. Okay. Because the ghost dad wasn't sad. Oh. That's the thing, like, the ghost dad wasn't sad. <laughs> Whoa! I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos. Who are we forgetting? I don't think you would put it on Burn Guy. Oh, he's down there. This guy was glue. That's where I got the glue from. Right. Oh, that's how you get past the dude. Oh, it only brings you here. Can I get the sticker? <laughs> Whoa! I should have. Right, let's see if I can get the sticker. Yeah, I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. And then put it on the guy who was blocking us. Yeah. Okay. Because I can't pick up the hat. Right. The medium hat. Right. It has to be about somebody who's unhappy. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing huh. here. Ah. 
because <laughs> whoa. I should have not stayed up all night because last night. Because I eating need burritos. the happy yeah, I have no for the doctor. Night eating burritos. I imagine. Okay. Can I drop this somehow? Hmm, there's a couple question marks still. Yeah. I didn't expect that. Okay, so... The one question mark is Dr. Brom. Uh, that won't... Yes. Okay. The other question mark is... Oh. Now it's letting me pick it up. Oh, that's weird. Yeah. Okay. And how does that make you feel? I've pulled back the veil between our world and the next one. <laughs> what? Huh? Are He's a medium. Any spirits <laughs> with which you would like to It's all in the hat. Dad, yep. I want to talk to my dad. He looks a little like me, only he's super old. Ghost of the skies, old dad, I command you here. What? Who called me? There we dad, go. It's me. I, I just wanted to talk to you, to make peace about how you love lobotomies, and I love treating people without cutting into their skulls. <laughs> Son, I, I, I have a mind to lobotomize you right here. You've been losing this argument for years, and now even when I'm dead, you drag me back so you can get one last word in of all the selfish. So now I think I need the smile. Yeah. Lobotomy actions to do. And another thing, son. I. I love you. And even though we have different approaches, we're both on the same team. Just. There we go. <laughs> what do the two question marks then? Yeah, I don't know. The fire guy? That I was thinking that, but I'm not sure. Right. I do now, Dad. That's my cue. You'll be good, boy. Hooray! At last! An emotional breakthrough! Closure! Huh? What? What happened? What did I miss? I talked to my dad. He's a ghost, and we talked, and we worked things out. I can go back to work now. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> what? Ghosts? Oh, that's crazy talk. You're crazy. What? No, I'm not crazy. He was a vision from beyond the grave. I'm not crazy. Next. I, I guess that's me. Excellent, excellent. Uh, sit down here. There we go. And tell me all about how whatever your issue is makes you feel. Oh, well, I've, I've got this giant spaghetti arm that comes out of my head. Definitely crazy. And <laughs> only I can see it. Oh, but it, but it lets me read people's minds. Telepathy, huh? <laughs> that definitely sounds crazy. Ooh, but before I give you my diagnosis, uh, there's one thing I'd like to try. Follow the pendulum. You are getting sleepy. You are about to tell me all your secrets. So dang sleepy. I hate when I become so dang sleepy. <laughs> so, uh, that... Well, once this cutscene ends, they'll probably end it for us here. This is my hypnotically induced fantasy land. Don't worry. Just behave as you normally would, knowing that I am always with you, watching and <laughs> silently judging. judging. Ah, sweet. <laughs> yeah, I think this is a cool game, too. I am very surprised with the production values it has that it was able to fit in a bsd episode you know yeah yeah so um i would highly recommend it for anyone who really likes point and click adventure uh, point and games. click adventure games unique mechanics i know there wasn't a lot of us 
uh, talking back and forth, but it's also because there was a lot of like key dialogue and right. whatnot in this game. Yeah. But yeah, Stick It to the Man is a really good game. And like I said, I, I beat this game and I loved every minute of it. Awesome. Well, guys, we will see you next month with uh, more games. Bye. See ya. We'll